Hi, Book Lovers. It's Lady Lauren X4. And I told myself that I wasn't going to do this, but I need to do this because I'm kind of bored now that I want to read. I told myself I wasn't going to read for the next two weeks, but I do. And I don't want to read fan fiction. I want to read some books to get them out the things. Let's do a how many books I can read TBR in two weeks. Let's just go ahead and do it. Let's look at the books. <laughs> All my books right now these are all the books i'm gonna try to get done in the next two weeks it's september 18th which is also my dog's birthday named prince he turned seven today it was hilarious i went had to go like to party city to get him his balloon to say prince on it and then i went to the bakery to get his dog treat that like says happy birthday is huge it's a huge treat so yes but so like, let's just jump into what i'm supposed to be reading in the next two weeks Gosh, let's just do this so the first book i'm supposed to be reading is a romance by uh Quana jackson and it's roman nick this is a story about a man who works at a meeting stationery shop, I think in Harlem or like New York. And he, his owners either die, I think they die. And the owner's daughter wants to sell, daughter or children wants to sell the place. And he doesn't want them to sell the place. And the daughter of the owners and him have a enemies to lover mentality. So, romance, enemies to lovers, it's nice, good book, good chunk. So, yes, I can't wait to read this one. Next, we have My Sister the Serial Killer by Oyinikan, Oyinikan Pratwati. I know I'm not saying that one right. Wow, I'm so sorry. But as the title says, her sister is a serial killer. This follows the younger sister of a serial killer, and her older sister always tends to kill her boyfriends, and then the younger sister always cleans up after her. This is supposed to be like a very dark humor type of thing. Or very funny, I've heard. So I will be reading for this one. Then we have Jenny Lee's and a K, which is a love story. I heard this was very gossip girly. I want to get into Jenny Lee. I have her other one. Um, so yes, I want to read this. <laughs> Next, we have Hot Stoppers by Alice Osmond. I told you guys I wanted to read this before. So I think this is a very quick read when I am in a reading slump and it will be fantabulous. This is the story of, this is a killing story. So I forgot the main premise, but this is how two boys fall in love. There is four in the series. So if I like this one, I'm probably gonna read the other three. Then we have um, Tim, Tim B. Lockett, or Lock, Tim B. Lockett, Tim B. Lock, from Scratch with a Memoir. I picked this up because it was just like on whim, and I'll see how I like it. Next is Awaki Izimi, Izimi, Izimai. Zimi Het. And this is the story of a girl who somehow creates a monster, but like no one believes her that the monsters are coming back because their world used to have monsters and the angels, which were like the councilman and the mayor, got rid of the monsters. 
then she accidentally creates a monster named Pet, and he eats monsters. There's like a lot going in here, and I'm already like a little bit into it. I think I'm on the second chapter, the third chapter. But yes, it's kind of cute and super small, so I am enjoying it for now. The next one I've actually already started reading is Burn by Patrick Meese. This was $9 on Mercy, you know, I was like, I like dragons. Let me buy it. So I did. And this is like girl with the trope of like the chosen one and the dragon he's a rare dragon and he seems to know her more than she knows herself he knows something that she doesn't know and he's there to protect her he is also is a very rare dragon he's a blue dragon a blue russian dragon so i'll find out what that means when i'm in the book i'm already like a good chunk and two so i'm liking it so far Last but not least is a memoir again. It is by Mariah Carey, The Meaning of Mariah Carey. I got this because it was 30% off at Target and I was just like, yes. Also, I heard, because I also bought the audiobook because she's reading it to us and I heard that she sings in the audiobook, so I went to read along with her. So, yes, this is it. So I hope to get all these done in the next two weeks until September 30th. Like I said, I can't wait because ugh, next month is my birthday month. Yay! And I have so many books on my wish list that I, I want to buy that are in my cart that I am going to buy. I am just waiting. <laughs> oh my gosh this is gonna be like a good birthday month <laughs> so i will see you guys in my next video i have a lot of videos so why don't you just stay and watch the others <laughs>